so you have multiple PDF files and you want to turn them into one single file and you really don't know how to do that well this video is here to show you how to do that so without any further ado let's get started hi this is Mark Tim back into Photoshop so for you to merge multiple PDF files inside Photoshop you just have to follow these few steps step one have the multiple PDF files you want to merge into one inside a particular folder step two have Photoshop and you are good to go so once you are done with these two steps the third step is very simple just dive right into Photoshop and go into file and scroll down into automate and when you go into automate just move to the right hand part and say click on the pdf presentation and when you click on that you are going to get this little window that's going to open up for you so at the right part at the left part you get a source file that is your pdf document if you have already opened them you have your pdf document inside of this little square or the window you have at this point and here is the output settings where you can what customize a PDF to be exactly what you want them to be so the first thing you want to do go to browse when you go to browse it's going to open up your Windows Explorer locate where you have your PDF files mine is in this PC and I have it in document and I've already created a folder called merge PDF files so we click on the folder and I have in the first part so I have over 266 PDF files in this folder so in order for me to merge all these PDF files into one I'm going to hit on ctrl A or command A on my keyboard to select everything and once you're done with the selection click on open and just give it some time and Photoshop is going to import all the PDF in to this window so now when you look at this they are not arranged in the, world, the normal way it's supposed to be we'll go back into the folder where i have the pdf you can see that i have them arranged one after the other i have one two three four five and six and so on but we don't have them like this inside of photoshop so what you are going to do to fix this come down to the sort name and when you click on that photoshop will automatically sort them to what have the same arrangement they have inside of the folder which you just import them from so at this right hand part if you want to save it as a presentation you can click on that and customize your settings including the names and so on but if you want to word save multiple page document you can just make use of this first one so since we want to save multiple page document we just would leave our settings the way it's supposed to be and would click on save when you click on the save button it's going to open up your windows explorer where you select your destination where you want the file to be saved after it's been merged into one so i'll save it inside of the pdf two folder which i have already created and you can what change the name so i'm just going to name this into merge pdf doc okay and i'll hit on okay now it's going to open up the pdf dialog box when you want to save your pdf from here you can decrease the size because it will be a very large file when you're done merging number files together from here you can customize the size of a pdf when you go into the compression you can make use of the word option if you don't want to word resize you want to keep it the same way you have them in a single pdf files you can make use of all these settings right here but for now i'm not going to go through these settings as we have right now so i'm just going to hit on what save pdf and give it some time photoshop will just take some time to do its work for you and once it's done you're just going to get that option that is what loading will just disappear once it's done so let's just wait and depending on how fast it's your system this is going to uh, be a little bit slow 
if your PC it's a little bit slow. So let's just give it some time. All right, so now it's done. What you want to do, go back into the folder. So I will go into my file explorer or click on that and go back into the merge PDF and click on the word the PDF to which I just have. And here we have the word merge PDF files according to how I save it. And if you look at the right hand part, you can see that we have this as what 6,959 kilobyte, which refers to what six. 600 600 and uh what i gotta say 600 megabyte yeah yes gotta say that 600 megabyte so now when you double click on that i don't have adobe acrobat reader right now it's stored in my system so i'm just going to make use of the microsoft edge to open this and view that but before we do this let's go back into the merge pdf and click on the pdf folder so let's open up maybe the first one and see what's inside the first one before we open up the main pdf document adjustment so this is what we have in the first pdf document so let's go back into the word the one we just merged double click on that and it's going to open up and let me just maximize this right now so we can see that we have it as what 266 which is all the pdf document that i have is 256 so let me scroll all the way down to the first one which is just what we have here as the word first document we just opened so this is how you are going to word merge multiple pdf files into one just right in photoshop without making use of any software if you like this video make sure to hit the subscribe button comment and word make sure to share see you guys in my next video and do have a nice day